Thank you. Thank you and good morning. It's a, a pleasure to be here with y'all and congratulations to Carl and Scott and the USA football staff for putting on a marvelous event. Uh, but I want to give you a little bit of my, as the lawyers would say, bona fides. I uh, coached Pop Warner and youth football. I've got four kids, two boys, two girls. Andrew's my oldest and coached him for a number of years until he got into the school system, seventh grade. Uh, so I've, I've been out in the field and uh, enjoyed coaching my sons and my two daughters more than perhaps anything I've done as a parent. Why do we coach? Why do people coach? People coach for two reasons, I think. One, they love the game. I love the game of football. I think it's the greatest game ever invented by mankind. And the second reason is, number two, we want to spend time with our kids. There's no better way to spend time with your kids than on a practice field, on a game field, right? Going to, coming back during the game or the practice, it's a great time for a parent to spend time with our kids. Our kids in today's world can easily get diverted with all the technology that exists. They can go down in the basement and watch TV and play video games and do all these things. And the old interaction that kids have with parents is fraying a little bit. And youth sports, and this, is, this includes all the sports, but I would say football most importantly. Youth sports is a great way for dads and for moms to spend time with their kids. I was a very simple coach. I wanted to accomplish two things, and I believe these two things are very important. I wanted, number one, to teach kids technique, right? I wanted to teach kids technique. And number two, I wanted to make sure that kids were having fun. I wanted to make sure kids were having fun. I wanted to see kids with a smile on their face at practice or at a game, right? So those are very simple metrics, if you will, right? Teaching techniques and making sure that kids were having fun. And the proof in the pudding was very simple as well. The proof in the pudding was, would that kid, would that football player play the following year? Did he want to play the following year? If that young boy learned technique, that young boy learned uh, how to get in the three-point stands, how to tackle, how to do all the things that we're teaching them to do, then I think he's going to have some fun. And if he has some fun, he's going to want to play next year. 